Hi, in this particular video, we'll see how to fix Fiam has encountered an error. Are you constantly being met with the Fiam has encountered an error? A session failure message when trying to play your favorite games on Fiam platform. This error can be frustrating and can prevent you from being able to play your games. But don't worry, these are all ways and there are some ways to fix it okay so in this particular video we'll see like what are the causes for the error which you are facing and we also see like how you can fix those error and you can overcome those error and you can start using the fire application okay, okay. So first we'll see like why you are getting some error. Okay, you have encountered an error means like it will show something like this. Fam has encountered an error. Okay, so these are the screenshots of the error for which you are facing. Okay, there are several ways or uh, there are several reasons like why you are getting these kind of errors. Okay, though reason number one is your system memory is full okay so every system has some limit for its uh, memory whether it can be like hard disk or something or it can be like ssd okay suppose if that memory is full like then you will definitely encounter some kind of error like this okay and that's the first cause and the second cause is like your driver is too old Okay, so make sure that your drivers are updated to the latest version or the uh, new version with the latest drivers. Okay, so make sure that you are not using older version of the graphic cards in your system or the PC. Okay, so you cannot run the program if you are using if you are uh, using the latest graphic cards where the driver remains the old model. That's the second cause. And the third cause is driver not installed in the PC. Okay. You may not you may not have installed your driver in your PC, which can be the reason like why you are unable to play this particular game. Okay, so when your driver is not installed, like then you will not be able to connect it with your graphic cards and you will not be able to play them. Okay, that's the third cause. And now we'll see like how to fix these kind of errors and how to overcome those kind of errors okay the first method is make sure that the driver is installed first firstly you have to make sure that the fact that your driver is installed properly in your system that will help you to make your graphic cards run the programs without having the driver installed in your system you will not be able to run any kind of games on your system okay so upgrade your driver to the latest version that's the second method like which you can follow okay so you also have to make sure that you have a latest version of your driver installed in you using in your new branded pc with the latest graphic cards both your driver and your graphic card should be the latest version if you are going to run the in many situation that assertion error occurs because the, the driver is the older version and the graphic card is the latest model or it can be a vice versa as soon as you upgrade your driver the issue should get resolved by itself there's the second method the third method is provide enough storage space to fire mode Sometimes the error occurs due to system does not have a, enough space to run the application. Your system will need space to run it, which will use it temporarily. You have installed the application in the disk and has a space over 50 GB to remain the safer side. If you do not have space left where you installed it, then try to uninstall and reinstall by putting the disk that has a enough space okay suppose if you do not have enough space in your driver then try to delete 
the files which you are not using it so that you will get the enough space in your time okay then probably you can again use this particular application okay that's the third the fourth method is uninstall and reinstall the pym application this is one of the simplest method what you can follow because uh, the, these kind of issues occur due to some kind of bugs or the glitch that are present in the PyM application and it would get resolved as soon as you uninstall the program. Okay, so once you uninstall it, try to restart your system, then once you restart your system, again you can install this particular application or the gaming software. That's the fourth method and the fifth method is delete the cookies and caches files in your PyM application. Okay, so press Windows R button, then here you can type percentage local app data percentage. So once you press OK here, you can check for PyM application. Then you can open that folder, go to the PyM application data. Now open the data folder from the folders open, then open the cache folder. Now delete all the folders which is named as server cache and server cache preview which are in it then open the storage folder and delete the caches from there too see uh, you can find this storage folder in the settings so here you can see storage so here once you go to storage so here you can see the temporary files so you can delete all the temporary files which are present okay so that's the fifth method and the sixth method is contact the customer service support team you can all you can always contact them they are always ready to help you and they will help you to fix this particular problem so support.cfx.re that's the website support.cfx.re once you visit this particular website here you can see submit a request so once you click on that here you can select help and support so here you can enter your email id subject description finally you can attach the screenshot of that particular error and you can submit it okay and the backend support team they will get back to you they will help you to fix the problem and they will help you to fix uh, the errors whatever you are facing and they will give you the solution okay so that's all about this thank you